Hello? Anyone home? I've got a pizza here. The door is unlocked. Uh, it's for Mr. Jordan Braverman. Mr. Braverman! Mr. Braverman? Ah, shit! Don't! <laughs> just take what you want and leave! What? Please, please, just don't hurt me! No, 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 Mr. Braverman, I'm Pete from Blamboni's Pizza. You ordered a thin crust bacon and mushroom pizza. I'm delivering it. I did? I did. <laughs> I remember now. So sorry. Um, Pete, right? Yeah. Right. Let me just go get your money then. Sure thing, Mr. Braverman. Sorry I scared you. Think nothing of it. Just a little spooked. Now, where did I put my money? I get my money somewhere. I know I got Keep it. Well, I mean, you just got up and started looking for I it. don't think I know what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, I came in, you freaked out, then you started looking for your money. You picked up a newspaper, sat down, started reading it. When I asked you what was going on, you freaked out again, and then you pulled your money out of your pocket. Yes, a $20 bill. Keep the change. You got here incredibly fast. Not that fast. Well, it couldn't have been more than one minute since I put the phone down. In fact, I'd wager to say it's been 50 seconds. Couldn't have done more than needed to know in 50 seconds. You know, we make everything fresh. It's the flambonies guarantee. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. you guys have known I was calling soon or something. You guys are pretty much our, our, uh, 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 you're, uh, just take it and leave, don't hurt me. Mr. Braverman, I delivered your pizza. You just gave me $20 for getting here in 50 seconds. <laughs> I did? Yeah, dude. Yes, I remember now. Do you? Yes, why wouldn't I? Well, it seems like you keep forgetting everything every minute or so. Is that so? Yeah. In fact, I want to try something really quick, if that's all right with you. Now, why would I want to do that? I'm a busy man. I've got pizza to eat. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it'll only take a second. It'd be a big help. Uh, you see, I'm majoring in psychology. Uh, it'd be good for my education. Well, <laughs> if it's for your education. All right. I want you to remember the number four. All right. And in just a second, I'm going to ask you to give it back to me. All right. What's the number? 42. All right. Now, in just a second, I'm going to ask you to give me that number. What number? The, the number we just agreed on. Which number is that now? 42. <laughs> Isn't that a little steep for a pizza? What? <laughs> I could have sworn the last time I got a pizza it was less than 20 bucks. <laughs> Done it again. Done what again? Forgotten. Forgotten what? Exactly. Ah, dead. No problem. What in the world did Don't you just do? Well, you scared me. What are you still doing here? Well, I meant to get my money for the pizza, but then he acted like I was going to rob him. Um, yeah. That happens with him from time to time. Yeah, but you got freaked out, too. I mean, I'm not that terrifying anymore. <laughs> That's a whole other conversation, Sugar. <laughs> <laughs> You want to know what's up with Mr. Braverman? Yeah, it's been bugging me this whole time. <laughs> He's got short-term memory loss. Short-term memory loss? The fish from Finding Nemo, yes. It's a real thing. <laughs> and while he may not be cognizant enough to take offense to jokes comparing him to fish, I still don't allow that. do that. I'm not a monster. Yeah, well, those creepy eyes say otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> Is that why everybody really keeps getting freaked out? Probably. Who knows? Why are you people in my living room? Deb, nurse, short-term memory loss, pizza. Yes, right. Thanks, Deb. So is that some kind of system that helps them remember? Yep. How does it work? Hypnosis. Hypnosis? Yeah. A hypnotist back at the hospital managed to get inside his head and rig up this way to help him remember stuff. All it takes is a few key words to the main events of what's happened. So he forgets everything that's happened every minute? Every 50 seconds to be exact, which reminds me. Deb, 
nurse, short-term memory loss, pizza, conversation. Yep, I'm messed up in the head. <laughs> wow. I, know. I gotta be honest though, I don't envy your job having to do that for him every 50 seconds. Well, the pay is pretty good, and to be honest, sometimes I get to have a little fun. Well, how do you make a paycheck doing this? Well, the only way Mr. Braverman gets this kind of care is because he's filthy, stinking rich. Really? Why does he live in this piece of shit uh, place? <laughs> well, he used to live in a mansion, but the damn place got so big, he just wound up getting lost. Eventually, he had no idea where the kitchen was and actually spent a week eating the potpourri in the living room. <laughs> I did? Yes, sir. I'm certainly glad I don't remember that. <laughs> <laughs> but how do you uh, have fun? Well, everything is new to him, so I get to tell him the same jokes every day. Puts him in a good mood all day. Okay, so you mean like I get to help somebody, but he's a little Not quite. <laughs> Dev, nurse, short-term memory loss, Super Bowl. Who won? Patriots, Mr. Braverman. Come on, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's pretty fun. Okay. <laughs> uh, Mr. Braverman, you lost. Fair and square. Pay up. Fine, fine. I'm a man of my word. How much did we bet again? $500. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's right. Darn, I used to be so much better at this in the old days. That hardly seems legal. Oh, he gets better. <laughs> World War II, Murphy and Skid, Pendinger. Get there, boy! How about you, Steve? Oh, that question. 
Yeah. Well, about a week or so into working for Mr. Bregman, I found my justification to do this. What's that? Was, was I a ghost this past Halloween? I found this in my closet. Call me Tuesday. Call you Tuesday. <laughs> 